Welcome to the Boat Show. Today we're at Barker Boat Works and we're with the president, Kevin Basirico. How are you doing, Kevin? Good. How about yourself? So, you know, the catamaran market is really taking off. What are we standing on today? This is our 40 cat. It's the 40 HPC. It's a Michael Peters designed hull, um, 12 foot beam, and uh, you got quad 400s on this particular boat. Giddy up. So before we get into the details, let's talk about the advantages of a catamaran over a typical like center console. Sure. Uh, I think the biggest one is that most people talk about is stability, um, and then also just real estate. You know, a cat, you're you're carrying that beam forward, so you're going to have a lot more real estate than your traditional mono hole in the same class. So as we talk about uh, Barker Boat Works, tell us how you guys got started and the history behind it. Sure. Uh, the company was founded in 2015. Uh, our first boat that we brought to market in 2016 was our 26 uh, Bay Boat, which is the Calabogie Bay. That's also a Michael Peters design boat. It's the uh, SVVT hull, um, which a lot of people are running these days, a very, very tried and true hull. Um, and then next we came out with our 26 Open, which is now our most popular model. And then two years ago at this show, we introduced the 40 HPC. So Kevin, break down the DNA of Barker Boat Works for us. Sure. So we've been become known uh, for our fit and finish, and that's uh, something that customers expect from us is a yacht quality, best in class fit and finish, as well as our customer service. So you know, from the initial sea trial all the way through the build and post service, we have an in-house service center, and uh, that's that's what we pride ourselves on: is fit and finish, quality components, and customer service. So as we're talking about the 40 HPC with these quad marks on it, tell us about the performance. Sure. So top end on this particular boat, you're looking at uh, just over 70 miles an hour. And at a cruise between 40 to 55 miles an hour, you're going to be looking at burning about 0.9 miles per gallon. And how much fuel do we have on board for capacity? The total capacity is 770. So you're oh. looking at a range in the mid sixes. That's fantastic. Now, here we are in the aft end, and if you're ready to fish, this is where it's going to happen, correct? No doubt. No doubt. So talk about the live wells and everything else we have going on back here. So we've got four 55-gallon um, wells on this boat. So you've got two on the transom, you've got two in-floor wells, and then on either side here we've got some coolers where you can put some frozen baits. We can also outfit those for twin uh, medium or small tuna tubes. And then just behind us here, uh, we can outfit this with seven XL tuna tubes. They can hold beverages as well, correct? That's correct. Of course they can. <laughs> Always. So when we talk about the fishability on this boat, we got rod holders, rocket launchers. What else do we have? Uh, you got rod holders galore, um, rocket launchers. You've got two uh, dive doors or tuna doors on either side. Uh, we've actually done something a little different on our platform back here. So, you know, you, instead of your traditional splash well, uh, we put a essentially a plate over it to make it usable space. So whether you're fishing, whether you're diving, whether you're hanging out with the family at the sandbar, it's it's usable space. And you know, the feedback we've got from our customers is they absolutely love it. And the customers have some input on all these decisions. Like as we move forward to the helm, let's talk about the helm a little bit. Sure. Um, so the boat comes outfitted with uh, Mercury JPO. Uh, that's a standard option. Uh, we've got twin 24-inch Garmin displays, uh, six-foot open array. Um, we've got an option for a night vision camera. Um, but really, all you're going to need, uh, you know, for a day on the water. And we have nice, comfortable seats up here. Two rows for you and all your friends, correct? That's correct. So standard is our single row, um, but by far uh, the most popular option on the 40 HPC now has been this dual row. So, you know, guys want to run far, right? So you're running 100, 200 miles, um, you know, one way sometimes. And the fact that we can fit six comfortably and you can kick back, have a beverage, maybe take a nap um, is a game changer for sure. And I'm sure your wives and everybody on board, they wouldn't mind riding on this boat either, correct? No, it makes for a, a great sunset wine and cheese uh, type of cruise boat as well. Um, these, these forward helm chairs actually all pivot around. So whether you want to watch the spread when you're trolling or whether you're entertaining, um, it's a great option as well as we have some removable transom seating. So again, when you're entertaining, you're not using the live wells, you've got the ability to have another four to six people sitting here on the transom, incredibly comfortable. Um, and seats all around. So as we talk about the bow, it's all about getting up to the bow, the space on it, and the fishability all over this boat. 
That's right. Um, you know, another advantage of any center console, right, is fighting a big fish. You can fight it from the bow. You can chase it. You're not having to back down on it. Um, so that's certainly an advantage. There's a ton of room forward. Um, there's four frigid, rigid uh, built fish boxes. We've got a 800 quart, uh, two 800 quart fish boxes, and two 544 quart fish boxes. So they'll hold ice for days. Um, and then you've got a nice forward lounge, which can be converted into a fridge freezer for your beverages, for your food. You want to shoot off to the Bahamas, not worry about ice. It's a great option as well. Well, fantastic. Obviously, this is a very versatile, safe, offshore vessel ready for fishing, the family, and everything else we have going on, correct? That's right. That's what it's all about. So as beautiful as this boat is on video, what you really should do is step aboard, kick the tires a little bit, and check it out for yourself because this one's an absolute beauty. Thank you so much.